Is everything in place? Almost. What do you mean, almost? I have spoken with Montreal. The broadcast satellites are ours when we need them. A few weeks of discomfort and the public will be primed for our recall. And the clinics? We control the post rates. They will do as we say. I still think we should wait for the referendum. We can't afford to wait. America's science board convenes next month. But the mood among the delegates is shifting. I'm positive that given more time... No. By going public with this discovery, Saref is forcing our hand. change overnight just because David Sarif will it. Besides, we can do nothing until our biochip is ready. I thought you said you were close. Finding the correct nerve interface has proven more challenging than anticipated. Fortunately, thanks to David, I now know where to look. Washington tonight, crowds continue to gather in front of the Capitol. Most are demanding that Congress severely restrict efforts to alter the human body's abilities. This in response to claims made by biotechnology expert David Seraf that his firm may have discovered a way to make human-controlled evolution available to all. Seraf Industries researchers are set to arrive in Washington tomorrow to defend their claim. But for tonight, this is Eliza Kassab. With all due respect, Major, I'll expect two security details waiting for us, on the tarmac. No, we won't be going through the terminal, it's too exposed. Yes. I'm glad you understand. Good night, idiot. Something wrong? No, not for me it isn't. But you keep pulling on that necklace, Dr. Reed, and you're gonna break it. Come on, Meg. You've defended your research before. That was different. Then it was all just theories. But this discovery, Adam? It's big. Kepler big. Rosetta Stone big. So, what's the problem? They'll want to know how I found it. Megan, we're leaving for DC and... Adam, you're there. Good, good. You need something, boss? Yeah. I want to go over your security plans for Washington before we leave. You and your team ready to go, Megan? Almost, David. We're just rechecking data. Well, make it snappy. We have to actually be in Washington before you can dazzle all those federally appointed know-it-alls. <sighs> I hate it when he does that. Come on, I'll walk you part way. All right, well, uh, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. Today, we are starting Doe 6. I don't know if I'm saying that right. <laughs> and uh, do let me know if I'm not, because I would prefer to not embarrass myself in public. But anyway, um, we just finished a couple of games and this one uh ended up being the highest rated in uh my patreon and youtube member poll so uh here we are i've been interested in playing this game for a while because i heard so much about it and um i am not trying out the original dose dose six again embarrassing myself right now so hopefully that won't be the case in the future please adam <laughs> she looks like she has to pee. This is weird. But, um, regardless. I am not playing the original right now because I don't know if there is any interest in, uh, seeing it from anyone. I would like to, and I would probably do it in my own time, but if you do want to see me, uh, go through we would, that one, uh, please do let me know. I would really appreciate that. But, um, setting that aside, let's check out what this game is about. Let's get into it. Okay, the mouse might be a little too fast for me, so, uh, <laughs> give me a second to hopefully fix that. 
All right, this feels better. Um, I am currently playing this game on, uh, I guess you would say normal. The game says that this is how you're meant to experience this game. <laughs> so hopefully this is going to be right. Let's see. I know I'm slow, but I'm looking at things. So far, I have no idea what's going on, and this is uh, Biohazard. Uh, that's fun. This looks like it's all wrapped in plastic. Lots and lots of trash on the floor. I don't appreciate that. Please, Adam. I'm nervous enough. Okay, okay, fine. Can I look at? Oh, I can look at this. Patient X. That's nothing, Adam. Just some of the research. Look, we really have to go. DNA analysis of sample taken shows unusually high presence of mutagenic chemicals in the primary strand. And I These don't appear to be harmful, however. Lady. In fact, X appears to be healthier and more resilient to infection than most subjects of a similar age and ethnic background. Although admittedly, this is based on personal observation only. Access to X's medical files and history is not possible at this time. Can I go David to the other page? We shouldn't keep yes. Him. More interesting to note, however, is what these chemicals do when isolated and introduced to the P dot cluster. In less than 24 hours, tw uh, artificial materials within the cluster have been completely encapsulated in a thick semi-permeable coating of yes. subject's own neural tissue. In effect, the invaders are being disguised as part of subject's nervous system. Tests have yet to be concluded, but it is my belief that PDOT's clusters built with this unique DNA signature will be undetectable to the human immune system. The bond between what is nervous system and what is external device will be blurred to such an extent that no glial tissue built up will occur. I feel like I need to brush up on my terminology while playing this game. Um, okay. Neuropozine may no longer be needed. The ones who kept men waiting. Woman, give me time. Ferris College. Are you coming? In a second. Washington braces for historic augmentation hearings. This is cool. David's waiting at him. Can't click on any of him. this. Sources close to billionaire Hugh Darrow say that. Panacea? Like panacea kind of thing? <laughs> the Arctic installation designed to stem the advance of global warming is nearing completion. Oh no! It's more like Pangea, like the... Yeah, okay. We all know what that is. Citing the need to oversee the project himself, Darrow is yet to confirm his attendance at the National Science Board hearings in Washington, D.C. How cool. Was Please, there... Adam. I'm nervous enough. Okay. I thought I could, like, look at this code thing. But it doesn't seem to be picking it up. There's so much you know, stuff! You really should get in the habit of locking your computer, Meg. I know, I know. Frank gets on me about it, too. <laughs> Call me. Megan, honey, why aren't you picking up your phone? I've tried you at your house and, and at your office. Were the ones who kept I've waiting. probably left a million messages with that receptionist there. Cindy, is it? I'm really starting to get worried, hon. At least when you and Adam were together. Ooh. I knew he'd make sure you eat every once in a while. I don't suppose you found some nice new man to keep you company, or are you still just burying yourself David's in work? Like mother, like daughter, I guess. 
Seriously, call me at the lab. I want to know you're okay, Mom. I told you, Megan, those kinds of questions fall under a slew of legal protections. Proprietary information, patient confidentiality, you name it. Denzel and his legal team are going to be right there next to you, waiting to jump all over their asses the second they ask. Just stick to the science. You'll be fine. David, I'm scared. What if they ask me where I got the first sample? What if they ask about patient X? Ooh, the one we read about. I don't know how to answer that. Diane. Meg. You're Please, only Adam, going for three days, right? Enough. So it shouldn't be a problem. Just drop the keys off before you leave. Diane, I'm really in a bind. Doggy daycare is full and I can't find anyone to take care of Kubrick. Kubrick? Aw. Can you do it? Adam's always been my backup, technically. Kubrick is his dog. <laughs> but obviously not this time. Say yes, please. And I thought women He's a really sweet dog. Men waiting. Hey! Stop reading my email. Uh, don't leave your computer unlocked <laughs> because I like to snoop. Hi, Megan. Genetic Marvel. Ooh, is this Patient X? I know you had some questions about the files I sent. Sorry about all graphs earlier, but that sample was nothing short of groundbreaking and I got excited. We shouldn't keep I don't suppose you could tell me where you got it? No, this is the title of the email. Okay, it's not from him. Oh, it's from Rebecca Downey. Gotcha. Uh, the short answer to the original breakdown I sent is this. Yes, the DNA samples are remarkable and we were unbelievably lucky to catch the reason why. We've been working with uh, VersaLife's new chaos model Genomatrix. I said that really weird. Um, which is trying to apply fractal mathematics to the study of genetic mutation. In essence, we've been trying to predict the future of human evolution using past mutations stored in the database of our mitochondria, <laughs> which is Adam, past uninterrupted from ancestral Eve, our mothers. It gives us an accurate and universal roadmap for our common past. The thing is, the simple, the sample you sent, it's one of our evolutionary models of the future. We're talking about someone who is ahead of the genetic curve by one step, maybe two. Were the ones who kept Do you know waiting? what this could mean for medicine alone? We have a living, breathing Nobel Prize on our hands. The thing is, I can't tell if this is a natural leap in evolution or something done to the mother while the baby was in vitro. But I do know that this person's mother had no such mutations. The mitochondria don't lie. And they are also a powerhouse of cell. <laughs> anyway. Being more. Electric systems loss. Okay, I can crouch. I know that. Uh, can I? I can jump. That's good. There's a whole lot of stuff going on outside of here. Slowpoke. All right, fine. Warning: This lab is for authorized personnel only. Thank you. What did you mean back there, Meg? About how you found it? Nothing. It's just my nerves talking. There's something I should know about this place, about Sarif. Megan, hold on. We're still getting biochemical fluctuations across the artificial flow cells. Okay. But the increased neural peptides coming from the P-Dot cluster could P -dot. be throwing off your calibrations. Right. I'll double-check that. I can't believe you were asking about David. You've been here long enough to know of... Eric! You wouldn't be avoiding me, would you? I wouldn't dream of it, Dr. Reed. I think I know why Declan's readings are off. Too many peptides? I'm thinking the glial tissue breakdown we noticed after splicing in the repressive glial. might be the cause. If we had a better cytometer... We might get a more accurate reading than the terms of the company. I'll ask David to consider it. Well, if he orders one from Page Industries, maybe they'll throw in another cappuccino maker. You overthink everything, Adam. The work we're doing is good. We're helping people overcome their physical limitations. 
Yeah, except most of our clients seem to be DOD. You're doing it's good. It's not all military. Just another hour to go. We work with teachers, doctors, construction workers. Oh. <gasps> Damn it! Watch it, Eddie. Those boxes are worth more than your salary. Sorry, sorry. Nia, you almost ready? Washington? Huh. Ah, Dr. Reed. This is General O'Neill. Dr. Sevchenko was telling me you've made progress on the typhoon. Yes, thanks to Vasily, actually. As I was saying, sir, the typhoon uses a modified combat chassis like the one I'm wearing. But I've improved its design using shaped microchargers to propel the steel balls. And the back glass problem? Solved through kinetic bleeders in the augment. Here, watch. Go ahead. Oh. Impressive. Okay. How soon till it's ready? I'm afraid I have to run, but Vasily has all the details, General. Of course. We still have some work to do to improve the time. You're right. The teacher would just love having one of those things. You're missing the point. Defense contracts keep us afloat, but neural augmentations that make you think faster react quicker. They can really improve a life, everybody's lives. David's talked about it for years. Yeah, he is a talker. He's a good man. Admit it, Adam. A part of you likes him. Oh, I like everyone, Dr. Reed. Yeah, right. Interesting. Okay. I am getting How far are you going? a feeling Diane's of Ray. I forgot to leave her in here. So she can walk Kubrick. His Kubrick, company, you know, not Kubrick. Keeps knocking over all my plants. Did you destroy that vase yet? I moved it. And I fenced in the yard. Like you always said you were going to. Yeah, never got around to that. <laughs> Sorry. Me too. About a lot of things. Oh. Adam, I... There's something I... Hello? Good evening. Who are you? Richard. So, are we all ready for the trip? There's Farida. I'd better hurry. See you at the helipad. Farida? Sure. There's even a helicopter! Did I uh, interrupt something, Jensen? You fix Jensen. that firewall yet? You don't fix an entire firewall. You find the loophole and plug it. Then did you plug it? Yes, I did. Want to know how? Oh, wait, I forgot. Ex-cop. I doubt you'd understand. X SWAT, and you'd be surprised. Seraph has to see you too. Athena. She wants me to show her how to track our scientist implanted locator devices. In case your security plans in Washington don't measure up. They huh. will. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you both. Go right in, Adam. He's waiting. This is the newest in encrypted GPL trackers, Athena. It transmits data to Right. Adam Jensen? By my side. The man doesn't jump for anyone. He's a Nobel Prize winner. Senators love this guy, Lyle. The hearings will go much smoother with him there. Big day for us tomorrow. Everything in place? Yes, sir. Capitol Police will escort us to the hill, and then Federal Protection Services takes over. Good, good. How's our girl holding up? She's nervous. All she has to do is show him her research. She explained it to you? Not really into the whole science thing, boss. It's incredible. All those purists out there accusing us of tampering with the natural order when all Megan's done is figure out how to unlock the potential that exists within our own DNA. It's safer and easier than anything you Darrow ever did. Environmental malfunction. Oh. Laboratory subsection six. All lab chiefs, please report in. We better not take any chances. Not tonight. Use my elevator to get down there. You know the code? Yeah, 0451. 0451. Athena, get someone to shut off the damn racket. Yes, sir. Athena? Is Athena a person? Or an AI? Do we have AIs in this? Oh, wait. Chair. Hurry up, Adam. I know it's an emergency, but I'm new to this game, so I need to figure this out. Okay, we got a suitcase. A suitcase.
super electromagnetic field. All right. This is very cool looking. And are we supposedly in Chicago? Is that what they said? Oh, look at that chess set. Oh, four, five, one, Adam. Yes, yes. Hey, come on. I need you to get on top of this. Is this a calculator or a phone or what? All right, it doesn't look like there's anything we can actually do. Can I type, is the question. Oh, yes. Nice. Pritchard, where's Megan? She reporting yet? Her GPL implant shows her moving through the micro chem labs. I think she's running. Damn. Must have been a serious equipment failure. Can you get eyes on her? I'm trying, but the IntelliCams aren't responding. There's interference coming from somewhere. Find out what's happening, Jensen. Do I have a gun? Richard. I... Richard. Thank you <laughs> for answering that question. Before you can do anything, you must be able to get around. The first move you'll want to learn is the crouch. Thank you. It will allow you to get into small spaces such as air vents, or to hide behind low objects so you can move about unnoticed. Jumping on objects or ladders is essential for getting to those hard to reach places. Sometimes going high or low is not enough. Sometimes you just need to go fast. <laughs> You'll only be able to sprint for a few seconds at a time though, so use it wisely. Oh, Mass Effect style. Do we have a map? Do we have anything? What is it? No, okay. Uh, let me check the controls real quick. Alright, I think I got it. I can't use map right now. I think it might be by design. But... I have an idea about the other controls, at least. This crouch is very fast. I appreciate that. Oh, she's alive! Okay, good. Maybe I shouldn't be crouching yet. Uh, that's a hand. That does not look fun. Did I see something on my screen just now? Maybe not. Alright, lady. Oh, well. Now you're dead. I'm sorry. Move! Oh, it's this kind of game. Very cool. So there's quite a bit of stealth involved, I would assume. Sprinklers aren't doing the best of a job. See, this is why you spread them out at appropriate distances. I do appreciate that I have the the gun with the the, the laser target. It's uh, quite nice, I'd say. Can't loot anyone, but I can tell. What in the world has happened here? And where is Meg? Oh, they're screaming. They do not have enough sprinklers in here. I'm just saying. Oh, oh, sir. <gasps> Ooh. That is an augmented soldier who somehow did not see me or pay attention to me for whatever reason. I have questions. Moving objects. Tab. Eyeballs. Great.
Tutorials. Some objects in the environment can be picked up and moved. Use them to create paths to inaccessible areas, or as portable cover during a firefight. You can also throw them at the enemy. I if like need that be. idea. I was gonna say it didn't do much, but then he exploded the thing, so I, I guess it helped. A lot of them have hands on their desks. I don't know if I approve of that. Alright, so this is the object that it wanted me to move. So I can do that. And then crouch. And go- ooh. Nope, never mind. Doesn't this remind you guys of Prey if you played? Because it definitely does. Me. I thought I saw something. But it doesn't look like it. That's a whole arm! Alright. Elbow and everything. Great. Alright. So that's where that soldier was. So that's lovely. else for me to see. Can I pick up this? I can. We crouch with it. Ooh. Let's watch this. When the lead starts to fly, it's wise to take cover. This will protect you from bullets and explosives. To shoot, peek out from behind your cover spot, either to the side or from above. Then take aim and fire. Whenever possible, use cover when moving around. Line of sight is important. And by keeping behind cover, you'll stand a better chance that enemies won't get a bead on you. Uh, good. Oh, I had to release this. Okay. I didn't quite catch what you use to throw a thing, but I would assume since my gun is no longer here. What was that? Oh. Um, I might need to use the same button to fire as I would to throw. So I'm gonna try that out. If it works. If this doesn't open. I don't think it does anyway. So I think I missed something? Alright. What is it that I did not see? Let's figure it out. Restriction... Restricted. So it should be here, right? Um, sorry <laughs> about being dumb. But I am just figuring this out. It still does not open. Wait. This does, though. Okay, where's my fire extinguisher? Oh, great. I probably don't want to use this, actually. Oh. Keep running. Still watching case. Ah. How cool. Okay, that's not enough to catch him.
Why doesn't it? Isn't that doing anything to him? Nope. Okay. Never mind. I was wrong. I can't see him. Open wide. I see you. Oh, well, that was uh, fun. Wow, that takes a while for him to die. I kind of suck at shooting, don't I? Look at all of those bullets that are in the wall. Oh god. Ah. Okay, he's dead. Good. Can I loot him? No, I can't. <laughs> I probably don't really need to. Because it looks like my ammo is infinite for some reason. I, I mean, I appreciate that. Um, the question I have is if there is any way for me to improve my, my aim. Because that was quite horrible. That arm is not doing good. Right, so let's uh let's go. Oh, poor doc. That does not look good either. Okay, let's see. Hello? Wait, I don't see anyone shooting at me yet. He was telling me to go fast at this point. In the previous tutorial, so I'm gonna trust it. Oh! 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 I see how this works! Okay, so I like, I lean and then I can actually aim, instead of uh, shooting off my hip. I think this is what it's called, right? I don't know, I, I know very little about shooting in general. <laughs> okay, so they're all dead. I'm uh, trying to see if there's anything for me to find. Like those little logs that I read about. I read through. In the previous sequence. But it doesn't quite look like it. No computers. There's uh, quite a good number of autosaves, which I appreciate. Which I appreciate. 
That does not look good. Ooh, hello. Who shot you? Oh, oh, let's watch this. What are you? You're walking on tiptoes. I don't like it. Oh, this is crazy. Are we about to fight her? Got it. Good. There was more. I think there's another one. Good. Where in the hell did that tiptoe person went or go? Lots of bio waste. So, question is, why did we get attacked? How is it that attacked us all of a sudden? I did not realize I could take your guns. Is it inventory? No, I, oh, I can't access it right now. Okay. Moving on. Probably shouldn't walk on fire. Hello. Oh, God. Who the hell are you? I'm not looking good. I'm not looking good at all. I'm assuming that we're seeing. Today? Jesus, sorry. <laughs> So we're becoming half cyborg, is that right? I 
if not completely. Human revolution indeed, is what it seems like. Ebooks are scattered throughout most locations. Look for and read them to learn more about the world. Ah, uh, yeah, this is, this is a uh, very prey-like, I'd say. Six months. That's a quick recovery, I'd say. I always forget my sunglasses. Adam, it's David. You in the building? I Just entered now. the lobby. Sorry to pull you out of sick leave so soon, but uh, we've got a situation. A breaking out of Milwaukee Junction factory. Meet me at the helipad. I have to see Pritchard first. Something's wrong with my retinal enhancement. Frank's on the second floor in the tech lab. Make it quick. People's yep. lives are at stake. It is blinking. Oh yeah, it's definitely blinking. Okay, so now I can see the map. That's good. Stair, restroom, elevator. And, uh, that I don't know yet. Yeah, all of my stuff is going nutso. Look at this. Okay. Ooh, I have mission markers. What do you mean? I like. The least we can do is remind everyone of the sacrifices our scientists made for this company. For the world, even. Yeah, it's the reminding part that bothers me. I've been in therapy for months trying to forget that night. Seeing the bodies coming out all burned up like that. I wasn't there, but I heard it was gruesome. Megan, Eric, Vasily. The whole team gone in one awful flash. How could this have happened? The how is not So Meg is dead? Anymore. We need to honor them by being true to their vision. Show those terrorists that they can't stop us from finishing the job. It certainly sounds like Megan is dead. Um, right. Okay. Hello? How are you? You don't want to talk to me, that's fine. This can't be just a coincidence. We hardly know anything yet. What if it's a complete misunderstanding? Misunderstanding? Yeah, I could see the hostage takers now. Uh, don't take this the wrong way, but everybody up against the wall. I'm just saying, the only reason people are at the plant tonight is because we've been forced to work so much overtime ever since the first attacks. Good point. No one was supposed to be there, so maybe it's just a break-in gone bad. I somehow doubt that. So this one I can't use. So it must be that one elevator that I could. I know, but Jensen, isn't it a bit early to toss him back into the trenches? I hear he's almost fully recovered. His body accepted augmentations with remarkable ease, but that doesn't mean his mind did. I'm right here, guys. What happened when he was with SWAT? The Mexican Town Massacre wasn't his fault. Then why was he kicked off the force? I'm just saying he's too much of a risk. Yeah, do you mind? What else are you gonna say? Sports! <laughs> That's a great magazine name. Alright, so we need to go to the second floor to check out our implant situation. Hello. What do you say? Nothing. Oh. How do I hack this? Capture software rating too low to hack device. Security rating too. Ooh. I am going to like this game. Yeah. 
awesome. Okay, y'all aren't talking. There's a lot for me to get into. So the X must mean that I can't just open it. Which makes sense. Wait. Diane Gonzalez. How is our dog doing? Mika or Micah Will Lyle There's a second name under it Jerry Mayer Why is David keeping the SWAT team from going in right away? Doesn't he remember the last attack? You can't compare the two. Those guys were obviously military. These ones are just vandals. Vandals with guns and bullets that kill people. Look, David cares about his people, but he needs to protect his client's interests. Don't worry. Oh. I'm sure he's got a plan. I didn't realize uh, he meant a second attack kind of urgent. Ooh, this is open. This is cool. Let's look at it. Hello? Are you? About time. What happened? You get stuck in an air duct on the way over? Yeah, nice to see you too, Francis. Something's wrong with my Francis. retinal display. Can you fix it? If it's what I think it is, probably. Of course, it might be. Oh, looks like your left and right imaging processors weren't completely in sync. But don't worry, your sentinel health implant will kick in soon, repairing any damage that might have caused. Your retinal display should be fine Thanks. now. Its recognition software won't be picking up hostiles yet, but you should be seeing radar and targeting reticules. Biomedical data too, if you're in pain. Right. We done here? Because Seraph is waiting for me at the helipad. I know. Radicals have broken into our manufacturing plant and taken hostages. Maybe this time you'll actually save people. Dick? If you've got a problem with me, just say it. Versus, lucky for you... I'm gonna ignore that comment. We're done here. Yeah, no. If you got a problem with me, Pritchard, why don't you just say it and get it over with? Why no, Jensen? I don't have a problem with you. If anything, I blame myself. The mighty Pritchard blaming himself. <laughs> That's gotta be a first. I'm the one who told Sarif we needed a physical security team to protect us. If he'd read my report closely enough. Wait a second. Are you saying it was your idea to hire me? Not you, Jensen. I wanted Dynacore, Sharp Edge, or Bell Tower. All the top private security contractors were on my list, but Sarif wanted somebody in-house. And so did Dr. Reed. <sighs> yeah. I suggest you leave Megan out of this. Why, Jensen? It's no secret how close the two of you were. My, my. And let's face it, you'd just been fired from SWAT for that massacre in Mexican town. No one was about to hire you. You really have to stop getting your news from those Pikus blogs, Francis. They only confuse you. The point is, if Sarif had listened to me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But Megan, God love her, always did have Sarif's ear. Sarif's ear is going to be hearing a report about violence in the workplace if you keep this up. You really feel like continuing? Point taken. <laughs> All right. So, um... <clears throat> Oh, can I read this? Good. Nature of Neuroplasticity. Where are you, Adam? You don't have time to mess around. Get to the helipad, or something seriously bad is gonna happen. Oh, am I actually on the time limit? Because... <sighs> oh, this is just gonna save somewhere. Wait. Oh, okay. I don't quite know what that is. Right, let's uh, go to the helipad. Elevator. Hello. No, not an elevator. Never mind. Oh, helipad. All the contracts we lost because of the last attack. And the Washington hearings being postponed. Now this. Damn fanatics. Do you think the news is right? That a pro-human group is behind this, Mr. Cannon? 
Don't Bro spread human. rumors, Dabell. Sorry, sir. As if working so much wasn't bad enough. We gotta defend ourselves against a bunch of No? Oh, lunatics. there it is. So You're not Hello! Welcome back, Jensen. Didn't think we'd see you around here for a while yet. You know how it goes, Malik. Duty calls. Don't I know it. I was in my wingsuit halfway to the top of the Renaissance Center when I got the 911. But you? Six months is a hell of a short time to come back from the dead. That's what I you said. You sure you're ready for this? Are you suggesting I'm not? Only one way to find out. Yeah, she hasn't been... Um... Only one way to find out. Roger she hasn't that. been a bitch to us. The so. boss is already on board, arguing with the DPD's tactical response team. They've got the plant surrounded, but Mr. Seraph wants you to go in first. Are you all set here? Because the sooner we take off, the better it will be for everyone. Still need a few minutes. Or I'm ready. So I can delay. Uh, let's go. I'm ready. Great. Then let's get airborne. It is interesting, considering how um, insignificant the other guy made us feel for like the choice of us being picked as a security person. But they spent all this money and effort to, you know, save us and make us into this versus what we were before. So there must be something about us that is actually really good or beneficial to the company. And considering Meg wasn't there to advocate for us anymore. I am really curious. I told Farida to put us down on a roof. I don't want the crowd seeing you go in. Fine. As long as she pulls you out the minute I'm gone. So what am I looking at here? Who are these guys? Pro-human purists, or so they say. Oh. The same purists who've been firebombing limb clinics all over the country. You buy that? No, I don't think it's a coincidence they hit us today, only hours after we moved the Typhoon in for assembly line factory. The Typhoon? Megan's team was testing it the day that bastard... Who's on point for these guys? Adam. I know you and Megan were once... Who is on point for these guys? Goes by the name of Sanders. That's him, there. Zeke? He's an augmented Adam. So he can't be one of the mercs who attacked us. But he did know exactly how to get inside our plant. All right. So how do you want me to handle this? First priority is the Typhoon. I'm keeping SWAT out until you've secured it. As far as rules of engagement go, I'll defer to you. Lethal or non-lethal? Ooh. Let's give that a go. I don't know if that's going to work. I'm not looking to start a firefight in there, just neutralize them. Okay, but just make sure those bastards don't wake up and warn their friends. You remember what it's like in there? A lot of tight enclosed hallways, but the labs themselves are pretty open. High ceilings. So, do you want something you can use from a distance or up close? Distance, please. Give me something with distance. If I get too close, I'll take them out personally. Just try not to break anything expensive. The Typhoon should be in the factoring labs, but Pritchard will tell you more as you go in. I've got him running comms. Terrific. Anything else? Keep your eyes open for hostages. Free them if you can, but the Typhoon is your number one priority. Gotcha. We developed it for the Alphabet agencies, and if we don't deliver it to them intact and still a secret, well, I'm sure you'll get the job done right. I don't like his hairdo. Prepare for landing. That is one fat helicopter. Enter the manufacturing plant, secure the hostages. So, okay, so I can't see what I could potentially see. 
if the guys are hostile to me or not. Because I can definitely see the friendlies on my radar. That's good. This does not open. Oh, what do you do? Oh, never mind. I thought I could open it. Um, hmm. Right, well, let's talk Ready to you. To go in. Good. Seen a few of them coming out for a smoke every now and again, so be careful. And you guys are just hanging out? Oh. Hello. Whatever you are. There's another friendly. At any point during the game, you can access the in-game menu. The inventory holds all the items you are carrying with you. It has a fixed size, which can be upgraded through augmentation. Oh. You can move inventory items around, examine them, or combine them with upgrades. In the heat of battle, you can rely on the quick inventory instead. It allows you to quickly equip a weapon, change grenade type, or use an item. Simply press the keyboard key associated with the slot in which the desired item resides. Ah, I see. You can swap the content of a slot in and out as you please by accessing the inventory screen. The objective screen details your current missions and objectives. The log screen is a repository of all the emails and books you read on your journey. The map is a helpful tool that allows you to see where you are in relation to your objectives. Useful locations such as merchants and limb clinics are also marked. Limb the augmentation trees are where you can spend experience points to upgrade augmentations you own. Simply select an augmentation and choose which upgrade you want to buy. Upgrading augmentations can be done anywhere, at any time. I need to see if I can scale the UI, because this is a bit small. I will uh, be right back. Well, I don't think there is an option to change your um, UI scaling, which is a bit of a shame, but that's okay. I can deal. Um, F Serif. Right. Hello? Are you friend? You could be friend. Tell me you're the guy we've been twiddling our thumbs waiting for. SI Security. Name's Jensen. Jensen? Yeah. I thought I recognized you. Used to be on Team 2 till that Mexican town thing went down. I gotta say, you're the last person I pictured taking orders from a CEO. Things change. Not always for the better. What's my hairdo? Feel like getting in there and doing whatever it is your boss wants you to do? Because maybe then we can do our job. Yeah, tell me about these. We've got people inside. Any idea where I should look for them? Yeah. Your plant manager, Josie Thorpe, managed to slip a call out before someone snatched her cell. She said the hostages are being held in an office near the assembly labs. Makes sense. The workers were setting up for a production run. So they'd have been concentrated there. You know more about that than I would. Anything else? Intel on these purists. How much you got? How much you want? Uh. How many am I looking at down there? Hard to say. We've spotted three in the courtyard, maybe half a dozen inside. But that's a sketchy estimate at best, since we seem to be getting a loop playback off your IntelliCams. That shouldn't be possible. I told Seraph to make sure Pritchard overhauled the system. Well, someone inside must be tech savvy, because all we're seeing is a loop. For all we know, there could be five, ten, or three dozen perps in there. Well, look at you, Pritchett. Didn't actually do the thing that you are supposedly very good at. The leader's name is Sanders, right? What's his Sanders? story? Zeke Sanders. We're running background on him now. Looks like he fought two tours in the Gulf. One of them on the recycle military bill. You mean he's augmented? Seraph told me he's not. He used to be augmented. Says his augs made him do evil shit, so he ripped him out. 
Now he's got a whole crew of gullible street kids listening to his crap and ready to die for him. Or kill. I wonder, so if we actually pull off doing this mission without killing anyone, would that be to the benefit of the uh, augmented society? Because, you know, augments actually don't make us do anything bad, unless we really want to. They communicate any demands yet? Not yet, but I get the feeling they're not that organized. Most of the guys I've seen look like street bangers and thugs. The kind who get their jollies trashing equipment. You ask me, is the man in charge you have to worry about? Okay, fair. I think I've heard enough. You sure? Wouldn't want to make your boss unhappy. Jeez, dude. I got it from here. Sit tight. Wait for Seraph's signal. Like we got a choice. <laughs> right. Okay. Painkillers. All right. I need to... Wait. This is not what I wanted to do, but I'm interested. Inventory is what I wanted to see. So let's see. Um, I have this sniper tranquilizer gun. Cyber boost. What do you do, though? Replenish a sing single energy cell. Activation used from the inventory. Description. Cyber Boost Pro Energy is an artificial food energy source packed with proteins and carbohydrates. Sounds great. Painkillers. That must be our health por potion. Portion. <laughs> Gain a temporary increase of 25 health points up to a maximum. Ooh, never mind. A small bottle of pills contains one dose of medication which will increase the health bar above its usual maximum of 100. If the health bar is already full, once these extra points have been depleted, they will not regenerate. Oh, our health regenerates. That's awesome. Unless they mean that it regenerates upon using an item. Okay. Augmentation. Um, we don't have any points from what I can tell. Map. Change level. Oh, that's inconvenient. Oh, this is my target. Manufacturing plant. Oh, that's it. Right. Oh, I can do this. This is better. Okay. Email. Oh, yes. Good. So it does save. Perfect. So we can read this later. Okay. Good. Let's go. Hard? Is what it says? Jensen, it's me, Pritchard. Where are you? On a roof overlooking the plant. Good. Your point of entry should be through shipping and receiving. Should be, Francis. What the hell does that mean? We have an employee entrance there. Heavily guarded by purists, no doubt. So, if you're not a fan of the frontal assault, I suppose you could try accessing the building's roof. Ooh. This isn't where I came from, is it? Okay, so I'm not into the frontal assault, is what I said initially. So I need to get to the room. Well, probably there, honestly. There's really no other options for me right now that I can tell. Purity first. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, look at you. Look, there's more. Let's look around, though, real quick. 
Oh, I hear people. All right, I have nine darts. Let's quick save. Because I can finally actually do that on a whim. Can I shoot him? With the tranquilizer? Or do I just... Sneak? Okay, let's quick save again. Let's see what he's doing. I did not watch that tutorial. Probably should have. Interesting that I can use... the... the forklift. Ooh, hello. Stealth. Ooh. Being stealthy hinges on sight and sound. Crouching down will assure you are making the least amount of noise possible. Ah, nice. Line of sight is important, and by keeping behind cover, You'll stand a better chance that enemies won't detect you. Very good. Avoid jumping and sprinting, as it will certainly Stop give away your position. What the fuck is that? Aha! Uh -huh. Is the guy still here? Can I take him out? Press. I think he's sleeping. Can I take him? Oh! Can I take the dude though? No? Search. Hold. Where am I going with this? Put him in here. Dude, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to bang you on every corner. Something is out of battery for me. I wonder what that is. Ooh. I'm interested. There was something in here. What are you? Stun gun darts. Good. Um, can I? Okay. Yeah. Ah, got it. But I can't probably get up there, can I? Unless... Can I jump with the thing? Supposedly. Ooh! Okay. I see. And I need to get up there. Got it. I can probably use the tranquilizer gun, can't I? Yeah, that's the one that I have equipped. Oh, three. He's coming. There's something to loot.
Now the question is, can I lure them closer to me? Because that would be kind of nice. Or, now that this guy is hidden, maybe I can tranquilize him. I missed. Oh, he's investigating. That's very cool. There's no... I can't aim right now. Okay. That guy is definitely investigating. <laughs> I should be able to do this. Ooh, wait. I didn't mean to kill him. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna reload. Press. Got it. They don't mind that their friend is missing. That's interesting. Okay, so as soon as that guy goes behind, I should be able to just go. Oh god. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, I'll just wait for him here. We're actually here, probably. Because this seemed like a better spot to take him out. Don't mind me. This is fine. saw me. Who's over there? <clears throat> Shit. Can I hide from him? Like that. Oh god. I want to see if he's let let's go of me. No, does he? You should have stayed out of here. Shit. Keep running, asshole. You should have stayed out of here. <laughs> Go! 
goddamn not here. <laughs> got no guts. Goddamn not here. <laughs> oh, this is fun. I'll be waiting right here, Peckerwood. You come back and see. Hey, hey, get up. <gasps> he saw the person. Okay. Nice. Right. Take all. Okay. Uh, what is my health? My health looks good. Uh, the batteries on something are not looking good. I don't know what that means. Thank you. I'll take that. Did you drop any guns? You did. What about your friend that I stashed over here? Nothing. Besides the gun. Alright, we got the police car and this target. So let's quick save again and enter. Richard, I'm in. The door worked just fine. I'm happy for you. The Typhoon is in the factoring labs. Oh. There's an elevator just past the assembly labs that will take you to it. Got it. So I should have taken the roof now. Okay. Damn it. Already messing it up. Okay, so I need to go all the way. Ooh, people. Now the question is, if it still counts as non-lethal, if I make them go to sleep. Ooh, I like that. Can we close this door? Please, thank you. Joseph Smith? Really? Uh, line down. Bill, we've got more problems with the line in 9F. The rig is down and we need someone to take a look ASAP. I don't want to be the one to hold up production. It'll be my head on the block if it isn't fixed yesterday. Troy, supplies needed. This is news. Okay, so uh, Troy, we need copper wire stat. I don't know where your guy was this morning, but we never got the shipment. This is news to me. It should have been moody. I'll talk to him later. We'll send a guy over now with the copper. Should be half an hour max. Hello all. Management realizes that you have all been working long hours in the drive to fulfill recent military contracts. We recognize your increased efforts and we thank you for your unswerving dedication to getting the job done efficiently and with pride. The current increase in workload will last only two more weeks. Damn, that's a long time. On behalf of Seraph Industries, we thank you for your patience and dedication. Athene. I'm sure they provided them with compensation. Okay, let's do this. Is there anyone here? That I should be worried about. I don't see it. I don't see anyone here either. Ooh, look at this. This is neat. All right, my guy. I can't go here. And I should be going this way. That is not encouraging. Oh, hello. Did he just pull out a hot dog out of there?
So, question if I don't even know what any of this stuff means. If I drop from above, does that also create noise? Because I don't appreciate that. Whoops. Okay, so if I take him out, I need to pull him into this cage here, I think. Let's see. That's not good at all. Alright, so dropping down obviously creates a noise. So that makes me wonder if I shouldn't be here in the first place. But I don't think I can get back efficiently. However, maybe I can drop on this box? Good lord! Sir? Ooh-wee! Is he gonna see his hand poking out? He's right there. Okay. Let's see, where am I going? So if I can get up and up and up, I should be able to bypass them. So maybe that should be my strategy. Let's do it. Ooh. Okay. Stay out of here, pigs. We got hostages. <gasps> hostages. This is where they are. Give me an excuse. And none of these body balloons gets out of here alive. You hear me? Ah! Be quiet ah. about it, okay? We're taking a stand for the human race. This is self-defense. Oh, this is energy. Rush this place, I dare you. We've got a little surprise for you in here. Interesting. This is how it works. You reporters make sure you get all of this. Tell the world. Okay, I need just a little bit, and then I should be able to take him down. When you see what we find in here, then you'll know. Ugh. The sound of his elbow being dislocated that is awful. Too heavy. <laughs> Funny, I did not expect to actually pick it up. Close it. Temporary disruption of services. Uh, there seems to be a network problem, which... Oh, that's, that's from Pritchard. Network problem, which is preventing us from accessing external resources. We are investigating the breakage and will let you know as soon as services have been restored. Services have now been restored. Sam, can you send me the names and employee numbers for everyone who will be working this weekend? We'll have to generate new security passcodes for all volunteers. 
HQ wants us to keep a tight lid on this one. Right. What about you? What do you say? Josie Thorpe. Hi, everyone. As you know, we are nearing the final stages of production for the Typhoon system. First, I'd like to thank you all for your hard work and dedication over the past weeks. Everyone should be proud. To successfully meet the rapidly approaching deadline, we must make one final push. To do this, we will need to increase production, running the plant on 24-7 schedule. Excuse me. This means assembling a production staff for the next two weekends. If you are interested in working one or both of the weekend shifts, please sign up at my office. If you choose to work, you will be compensated accordingly. Hey Trish, gonna have to work again this weekend. We got an important rush job on Monday and they need to get the line set up before then. Now before you say anything, remember, it's time and a half and you know we need the cash. You didn't! I know we can use the extra money, but if I got to mom and dad's without you again... You know my dad's just going to ask why you're putting in so many hours at Area 51. He refuses to see the work you do as good. Can't we discuss this, please? Aww. Hello all. We've all been working extra hard to deliver on some large contracts. As we push our production quotas, I would like to remind all employees of the need to take the necessary steps to ensure quality and safety in the workplace. One hour seminars have been arranged in all sectors to review the AISO 23000 manufacturing standards and to look at any issues you may have regarding the maintenance of these guidelines. Your sector manager will contact each of you to arrange a time that works for everyone. We have the utmost confidence in the work you are doing. We urge you to attend these seminars as a means to ensure that we continue to innovate and strive for the quality that Serif Industries is known for. Greg. Right, of course. Um, ooh, I did not realize I can do this. Right, so. Let's see. So I wonder if the hostages could be in here somewhere? Let me see. Main missions. The Typhoon is in the factoring labs. I secure- right. Secure the hostages. This is the one. Seraph employees are being held as hostages somewhere inside the plant. I should keep an eye out if I want to rescue them. Okay. I should keep an eye out, and I am trying to do so. Two people? Three people. Lockers. Assembly. Right. Let's see if they move. Okay, one disappeared. That's good. So we might only need to deal with one or two. Well, one right now. Ooh, hello. Okay, no hostages here. And he's just standing. That's good. <laughs> Question I have is can I stash him somewhere? Let's band together and 
That is more secluded. No, no one in the bathroom? Good. Oh, this though. Sleepwalking world. Let me flip through this real quick and then I will read this later. Good. Good thing he didn't see me. Right. I might be able to get him once he does the same thing here. He stopped right here? You've got to be joking. Something over there? Uh. Oh. Nice. And he's already stashed. How convenient. Right, so we need our energy to regenerate, and after that, we can get the other guy. I like that he got alerted by a door. That's kind of awesome, to be honest. Alright, the energy should be done. So I just need this guy. Wait, is he not here? Lockers. I see. <laughs> he almost got me. Okay, so uh, I did not see any hostages in here or in here, but there is one more room that is left. Hello. No one. No one see to see to find. Wait, where does that go? Oh, got it. And close it. Jensen, I just tried to unlock the assembly lab door, but my override codes aren't working. Someone's changed the protocols. What? Didn't you plug the. I'm on it. But until I find this particular breach and fix it, you'll have to hack the door manually. Mm. Out. Let's see how can it do that. <clears throat> uh, that is not what I wanted when to do. When hacking, your goal is to take control of a device's registries, so you can access the security codes within. To do it, you must navigate the network, capturing nodes as you go along. You begin a hack from your point of entry in the system, the I.O. port. To capture a node, simply place the cursor over it, and hold the interaction button. A wheel will appear, showing you the programs that can be used against it. Traveling from node to node is accomplished using bridges. 
A bridge can be unidirectional or bidirectional, as shown by its arrows. Each time you capture a node, there is a chance the network will detect your presence. The higher a node's rating, the greater the likelihood that you will be detected. If detected, don't panic. You still have a chance, you just need to hurry. The network will try to trace your entry point and boot you out of the system. If you manage to capture the registries before the network trace reaches your I.O. port, you'll be okay. Curious. That sounds new to me. Attempts left. Great. Okay. 60%? Yike. Access granted. Oh, lovely. User credential de decrypted. Device unlocked. Awesome. Okay, so you just need to uh, click fast enough, I guess. Woo wee. Wait, what? Oh, decontamination. Wait a second. What are we doing now? Oh, unexplored map. There are people down below. Yeah. Jesus Christ, you killed him, man! He asked for it. Kept calling me a big No way, no way! I am not going to prison for this! Hate to tell you this, Trev. But once that bomb goes off, this guy won't be the last skinner in here for Bison. Shut up, J-Ro. Trevor, you gotta calm down. Help me find Yikes. Him. I'm telling you, man, these hands of lovers deserve what's coming to them. Okay, so um where am I going from here? All the way down. And I don't even see my... Well, this is my target, I suppose. Retrieve the Typhoon. Hostages might be here. There's a room back there. And this is a way in. Oh, now they're... Now they're, uh, going places. Okay. Kind of amused that they don't see me right now. There's one guy. Two guys. Any one of them is going to go up the stairs or not? What is he doing? <laughs> oh, this is too ballsy for me, my tastes. What is on the other side? I don't know, I suppose. Alright, I need this guy to turn around. And I can probably just go. Camera, that's no good. Oh my god. This is not good. What the fuck is that? I'm sorry. What? I'm in trouble. I see you, bro. Oh god. Yeah, I'm dead. This guy will be the last skin in here for Shut up, Jero. 
Okay, the camera. Coming in here to dig up shit is one thing. Whoa. That's not good. Okay, let's see what it says. After guards, security systems will be your prime area of concern, as they will trigger alarms that bring about heightened security. Trying to destroy these devices is a bad idea. Try instead to get around them. By timing your moves properly, you should be able to do so relatively easily. Okay. If an alarm does sound, guards will start looking for you. Fortunately, they won't sustain this level of alertness for long. Eventually, they will believe you fled the area and the alarm level will drop. Right. Where is he? I can't tell. Is he inside the room? I think he might be. Okay. Looks like something moving around over there. Yo, Wait. You in here, you better come out. Oh, packing. I see. I could have swore there was something here. It didn't notice me. Access granted. That's awesome. A thing. <sighs> okay. Oh, God. Two people. What are we doing? We're going to the other side. Got it. We potentially need to go upstairs. No, it doesn't. Well, there was a room there that could have held hostages. Huh. Whoa! No, I don't. I don't need to do this. I didn't mean to do this. Oh God! Why is he alerted? Yo, if you're here. You better come out. Wait. You're going down. Go ahead. Kick your head out. Shit. You're dead! Alright, I'm gonna reload. I didn't realize I alerted him somehow. I don't know about the hacker dude. Yeah, it feels weird leaving the world. What's he looking for? Proof that these fuckers are lying to us like this. Just like he said. Hope Zeke knows what he's doing. Okay. Not good. I need him to turn around. This is what I'm looking at. A little radar. Ooh. 
Oops. Okay. Storage room. Oh, gosh. All right, so I need to go to the server room, and I think I'm okay, generally. This is exciting. Ooh. What does that do? In order to unlock new abilities or augmentations, you must first gain experience in the form of XP points. You will receive these points when completing main objectives, side quests, or through special bonuses. Like completing a mission without being It'll detected. Be next time we discuss security loop. Once you've accumulated enough XP points, you will receive a Praxis point. Nice. These points are used to unlock upgrades to existing augmentations, and to unlock entirely new augmentations. There. Praxis kits, which can be found through exploration or purchased in limb clinics, will also give you instant Praxis points. To unlock an augmentation or upgrade, simply select it in the augmentation screen, check the cost, and, if you have enough Praxis points, activate it. I'm interested. Let's see. So that's gotta be here. I have one Praxis. Um, <clears throat> info link, radar, hacking capture, fortify. Retinal prosthesis, smart vision. There's so much <laughs> available. Wait, no. Energy converter. Ooh, I think I need that. Arm prosthetics. Okay, what does that do? Grants. Wait. Grants two energy cells. Activation automatic. Energy consumption none. Use recharges partially depleted energy cells. Activation automatic. Energy consumption now. N none. N now. Speeds up recharge. Grants extra. I think I want this. But there's also so much other stuff. Typhoon explosive. Mini explosive and a 360 arc. Okay. Protects against harmful gases. Allows to sprint for longer. Renders immune to toxic gas and gas grenades. Cool. Um, analyze people and persuade them. Ooh. I need two. Damn. What does that do? Know exactly when enemy combatants will drop out of their alarm state to return to a relaxed standing. Versus protects against the effects of concussion grenades. Very nice. What does that do? See through walls. Awesome. Take down multiple oppo opponents. Fall from any height without fear of injury. I did not know there was fall damage, but it makes sense. Protect from damage. Become invisible for a short period of time. Warning, people can still hear you move. That's awesome. I also need two for that. Uh, Variable per upgrade? What does that do? I do not understand. <laughs> Run and walk silently. Ooh. 
jump up to three meters high. That's awesome. I'm gonna have a lot of trouble finding which ones I actually want to use. Gain information about nodes on a network before making a decision. Uh, I did not know you could do that. I really want this, but I haven't really encountered a lot of decisions like that. So it kind of would make sense for perhaps um, this one. Maybe let's buy this. Yeah, I have two now. Okay, good. There's a guy above or below me. Let's see. Nothing I can do here. Traveler? Don't quite know where I'm going. There's a camera. Let's back up a little. Let's see, so what are we doing? Retrieve the typhoon and probably get to the elevator after that. I would assume. I don't know what that is. What is this? I don't know. What is this? Ooh. I should have saved. Step away from the console. Now! Oh, he's connected. Help me! That is not human first ideology Preacher from what I hear. Man. Where else would I be? Patch me to Seraph now. Is it stolen? Adam, it's David. You got the typhoon? Yeah. But you were right I about did. there being something more behind this. Because I've also got a dead purist in here with some pretty interesting cerebral implants. Don't touch him. We'll need an expert to recover his neural hub in case it's booby trapped. Copy okay. That. What about Sanders? SWAT's pressure me to let them off the leash. Find them before they do and deal with them. Ooh. Confront Zeke. Rescue Josie? How do I rescue Josie? Confront Zeke? This is the only... The only map that I have. The plant manager, Josie Thorpe, has been taken hostage by the terrorist leader. Ah! So, she must be where he is. So that's good. So let's go confront the dude, in that case. And quick save. Yeah. Is that where we are? Yeah, I think so. Okay, let's crouch and go up. Right. So this is a different floor, is it? Yeah, I don't think I've been here before. Okay.
Oh. I see. I need to go all the way to the top to the helipad. There's people, of course. Oh, the SWAT is here, too. Should I just go? If I'm supposed to run to the destination. Wait. No. Who? Sorry. What floor am I at? Almost. Almost the last one. So I need to go up again? Is that right? No. I actually need to go one below. Wait. Two below? What is the eye? Yeah. I am currently here. So the eye is me. And I need to go one below and... Wait, no. I can't even do that. Maybe this goes down. Oh, that must be the case. Okay, gotcha. Find some, something we could show to fight us. Are you saying we got nothing? I know, man. I think... I think it really messed up this time. Motherfucker, how are we gonna get out of this mess? We're not. We're just gonna be stuck. Okay, let's see. So, um... Straight across is where we need to go. To go down. Has he turned around yet? <gasps> Ooh. Shit. Too fast. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, God. Let's see. So I need to go across basically where I'm looking to find the other stair. Got it. I just go. Oh. Keep running. <laughs> nope. Can't do that. All right. So I was too hasty, as we can tell, already. Can't stay here. That guy's gonna come out. Let's see. This door. That's an option. Okay, let him come and turn around. Because that's what he did before. Okay. Good. Anything else we can see? Uh, where are we? Got bathrooms. A 
Oh, I see, I see, I see. Let's see what this guy does. So far, a whole lot of nothing. We can try going. Okay. Good for now. No. <laughs> Shit. That was so good. Until this moment. <laughs> we good. This is still going up. That's a concern. Because I thought it was going to go down. I think we're good, actually. Let's see. Yeah. I think we are. Nothing. No, wait. There's this. Wait, can I take it? Okay. Okay, let's let's do this. Don't lie to me. I don't want to hurt you. You're a civilian. But I will if you don't give me a choice. If you didn't want to hurt anyone, you should have stayed home tonight. Oh, look! Seraph's attack dog! You're here to clean up before the police bust in? Kinda. He thinks we're breaking the law. Shut up! All you body polluters break the laws. You're all the same. You're gonna have a hard time convincing people you're any different once they hear you had an AUG on your team. What? I found your attack dog in the factoring labs, trying to cut through security with his implanted hackware. Nice try, Cholo. But I would never let one of you freaks on my crew. Ah! Back off, Hector! I got business to take care of, understand? If only I would have taken the picture. Or something. And I'm not saying it is over here. But I gotta. I gotta check things out. So me and La Vieja, we're leaving. I don't like this. You know I can't let you go with her. Take it easy. I've got as much interest in finding out who's behind this as you do. I won't stop you. Not a chance. The sense now. Okay, I can't. I can't. I just can't. You know I can't let you go with her. Stand down, Hanser! I told you. Stand down or this bitch is dead. Bullshit. You're bigger than that. You don't kill civilians. Damn right. Yeah. I'm a decorated vet. And I won't be jerked around. I need to find out who's behind this. And right now the boss lady's my only ticket out of here. Listen to me. Whatever's going on, it's big. You've got a better chance of getting to the bottom of it if you work with me. But I can't do a thing until you let her go. Are you stupid? I don't work with Oggs. God, you must think I'm some kind Dude. of moron. And who can blame you? Because it's exactly what I must look like to everyone right now. Trapped in here by the cops, and my only option is to take a hostage. How I, did, I didn't that? consent to this, by the way. I was dying. You're doing better than you think. You said you're a vet, so I know you've got the balls to handle this. You don't need a civilian to get you out of here. You are played for a fool. You led your people into a trap, and now you're on the verge of getting yourself killed. Unless you let her go. You just think taking a hostage is your only way out of here. You're so committed to the tactic, you're not seeing any other solution. Nothing let else her go. To say. Shit! Reason. You just think that taking the hostage is your only way out of here. You're so committed to that tactic, you're not seeing any other solution. Let her go, and you will. Sorry, but I no. got no choice. Dude! I know you're kind. I saw it a million times in the Gulf. The only thing augmented goons like you care about is gaining the advantage. Just like the cops out there. I'd have to be stupid to do anything you tell me to. 
God damn it. The only thing the cops are focused on right now is the safety of the civilians, same as you. You've risked your life to do what's best for the other people. You're not some dry fi banger. The cops will be looking after the civilians, too occupied to worry about you. But if something happens to your civilian hostage, you will get their attention. The hostage is my only priority. Let's do this. The cops will be looking after civilians. They're too busy to worry about you. But if something happens to her, you will get their attention. Their priorities will shift, and all you'll accomplish is getting yourself killed. Nice try. But if they're so worried about this arm lover, then they'll make sure nothing happens to her, won't they? You've wasted enough of my time. That chink wire hit freak used my brother and screwed us over. Just like you kind of always does. I gotta find out why, so shove off, dear box. God damn it. Alright, you've got more honor than the man who betrayed you. You're not gonna let your brother down like this. You were supposed to take hostages and force the cops to silence you permanently, but you're smarter than this. Let's give it a go. You've got more honor than the man who betrayed you. You're not gonna let your brother down like this. The hacker was expecting civilians to be in the building tonight. You were supposed to take hostages and force the cops to silence you permanently. But you're smarter than he is. Oh, it's so obvious. Can't believe I didn't see it till now. He thinks he can just lead me to my death? Think again, cabron. Get out of here. I did what you wanted. So let me go. I got Blade here too, I see. I've oh, got as much interest in finding out. out who's really behind this as you do, cabron. Yeah, well. Maybe I'll owe you one. But I promise you this. Someone's gonna pay. Any sign of him? Adam! Adam, what's happening? What's your situation? Adam! Sanders is gone, boss. But I'm pretty sure he's just a dupe. Somebody else set this up. Damn it. Okay, I want you back here now. The admin building has a rooftop terrace. Meet Farida on it. What about the hostages? Shouldn't I? There's nothing you can do, son. So I couldn't uh, save him. I messed up. Damn it. I did skip a lot of areas, so I guess that doesn't surprise me. Alright guys, so this was episode 1 of Dosex Human Revolution. I am quite excited about the game. It looks like it provides you with a lot of options on how to approach a problem, which I really, really appreciate. And uh, like I mentioned throughout the gameplay, it really reminds me of Prey in that sense in particular. So I am quite excited to see what else it has to bring. And I hope you guys would like this series and I hope to see you in the comment section. Again, uh, if you did enjoy it, please consider leaving me a like and subscribing and uh, I will see you next time. Bye for now.